listen up you guys now i'm gonna go up go ahead and just play this little quick little clip and you know this go for all the people that was all you know when my video went viral on uh tiktok uh talking about rihanna and different things uh, you know, people get up on there and tell them, oh, you're crazy. She ain't doing nothing that's satanic or demonic. But this is going to show you the proof. Now, this is a different angle that somebody pretty much captured. I'm going to play it up here real quick. Why is no one talking about this? The sign that she's doing and also the shape of her stage. What's going on, guys? Now, I just, y'all seen from that clip, um, from that angle, you pretty much see that she was pulling her. And I didn't even see that part, you know, because I seen the halftime when I done a video about it. Uh, sorry that I had to delete it, but, you know, YouTube, they kept coming back to it and trying to mess with me. So I wound up just posting everything pretty much on TikTok. But y'all seen from that clip, you know, Rihanna, she literally put, you know, her hands up as a pyramid. And uh, I tried to go to tell everybody, you know, and there's a lot of people. I was getting persecuted all in the comments and stuff on TikTok. You know, people talking about, oh, you don't know what you're talking about. There was nothing to mind about it. She didn't do anything wrong. You know, it's just it's just a regular performance. See, this is what I mean when I say people are delusional. People don't even see truth if it even comes across them. And I'm telling you, and the Bible talks about it in those end times, you know, it's, it's going to be a strong delusion, and you're seeing it now. You know, people rather believe a lie rather than the truth. And the truth can be right there in front of their eyes, but they just don't take it because... They are so comfortable and they're so blinded by the God, the little G God of this world. And so and that's what you're seeing now in these days. You know, people are just giving in to a lot of things. You know, all these celebrities got these huge, big influence. And these, these, these celebrities, they can say anything, do whatever they can do right in front of the fans. And the fans are just going to take it because why they quote unquote got, you know, uh, all this status and money and influence over the Internet. But God can take all that away. God can God can put somebody in a position where, you know, if they were like mocking or disrespecting, you know, Jesus Christ, God can take they take their riches and all that they have and give it to a uh, to a believer who's going to really do right by the money, who's going to discipline, who's going to do things for the kingdom. These people are making money for their own pleasure. These people are making money for their own self. The Bible talk about you know the end times. You know, people are going to be lovers of themselves, lovers of money. You know. Uh, Rather have her pleasures in the world, you know, things of this world than the things of God, you know, and we're seeing that now. People are so greedy. Folks won't even want to give you a quarter. And it's very sad. Like we're coming in a time where we're going to have to trust God through it all, no matter what. But but God don't want you to be deceived by these celebrities. And you're going to see a lot of that. You're going to see a lot of celebrities being brought down. Even uh, mega pastors and stuff, they're going to be they're going to be put down, too. This is why we need to pray over this nation and pray over these people, because they don't understand what's going on and what's about to get ready to take place. God is not playing this year. 2023, I'm telling you, we're going to see a big, great move of God for his people. But on the other side, it's going to be wrath. So do you want to be on the good side of God or you want to be on the bad side? You got to choose this day who you're going to serve. And I'm telling you guys, this this is what these people do. They sign their life away. They give they they give they they whole soul to the devil. They have full access throughout their whole lives. They have to denounce Jesus Christ three times. You know, and this stuff is completely real and people don't want to believe it. And man, I've told this for so many years to certain people. They oh, I don't believe, I don't trust, I don't believe. See, that's that mindset. That's that mindset because there's a lot of people, uh, rappers that came out of the industry and exposed the industry. And it was basically saying like, you know what, I, you know, people used to tell me about this and warn me about that, about the industry. And I just never believed it. But then it was one day that the person actually got in the industry and they're like, oh my God, I, 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 I really would have wished that I would have listened to the person. But people tried to tell you the truth and people don't like it. And now these days, people don't like the truth. Social media don't like the truth. People don't like the truth. Nobody likes the truth anymore. So guys, do not be deceived by this. And I know I've talked about this a few times, but I was just like, like I said, I was scrolling through TikTok and that's this is one only thing I was pretty much saying that she actually did put up a pyramid. Now they didn't show that part, but whoever it was, they got a good angle of her doing it. And they're doing it right there in front of your eyes. And then the way that the thing was like floating in the air, like, like what they were standing on. Uh, if you've seen it from the clip, he was showing you that it was making a, a, a basically a, just a pyramid right in front of your eyes. And people still support it. People still, oh, there's nothing bad about it. Oh, it's just performance. <laughs> people just, people are just so delusional, man. People are so delusional. 
You don't want to be that person. And I thank God. I used to be delusional and crazy out there in the world. But I thank God for bringing me closer to him. Because now I'm able to see the truth. I'm able to see the light. And it just, it just really, you know, back in the day, I remember when people were more aware of things now. It's like people have let everything down. It's like the simplest things that you shouldn't be doing. They're catching themselves doing it because the world say it's okay. But it's but it's going to take you down this road and it's going to lead you straight to the destruction. And people don't want to hear stuff like this. But it is what it is. So guys, anybody want to follow me on Rumble, everything's in my description. Y'all know what to do. Got two videos I want everybody to check out. Anybody want to follow my TikTok? Uh, it's Tyrese Brown Official, I think 23, I believe. Tyrese Brown Official 23. If not, just put Tyrese Brown Official. And one of them, they're going to pop up. So I love you guys. Y'all be blessed. Until next time, Jesus Christ's name.